So I should have enough after just one more trip to buy the best things. So I am down to 1000 again, but that's because most of the price of that 2000 was for the uh, tool racks. So I now have enough to buy all of the upgrades with, if I'm, if I've done my maths correctly, literally one mark spare. So I don't want to be going into the live stream one with a single mark, so I will still need to do another one uh, to get some extra spending cash. I'm curious, can I repair tires? No, it seems it is just engine parts that can actually be fixed. There we go. So, this will be the final trip I need to make in the trading run, I hope. And then, uh, hang on, let me just check. There is actually a decently brief trip. There is not, okay. There we go. Soft reset later, and I have a 210 kilometer trip. So this will be the last trip I need to make in the trading run. I've got two sets of fully repaired tires. I've got like three car jacks that I can sell because I had to keep soft resetting and a couple of full fuel tanks as well, all the engine parts. And as I'm currently one below the max, the, the minimum, that should give me about 120 to spend on uh, hotels. So let's see, it'll be about 20, 40. All right, if we go for worst case scenario for hotels, 20 first night, 25 seconds, 45. And then uh, 25 again, so 50, 70, and then 30, 100, 135, double that. Okay, 270 is what I think the maximum will be for the... Oh no, I, I, there might be a 40 or a 45. Okay, so what I will do is I will have all this cash. Uh, I'll have about 100 spare. And that'll do me for a few days. So all I need to do is find some stuff in those few days. Oh wait, there's like petrol and stuff. Hmm. Might do a second run after this. J sorry, one more trip. Just after there. Fuck it. I think I'll actually open these boxes. Because depending on what's inside... Ah. Okay. <laughs> I was thinking... I had a bit of a ramble earlier about um, whether... I would have to do another trip after this one, but finding a load of wine has clinched it. I do not need to, because even if that wine only sells for 50 each, that's 150 for the three bottles, and that is more than enough to take me over the spending money I will want to do the there and back again run, which is what the live stream will be. Also, every time I've got to this point, I've made a, uh, a decision to not bother going around this roundabout, and I just go straight over it. Woo! So I will probably have to pay some fines when I actually do the trip. I need to take that into account. But I should have plenty of money if I sell all of the stuff I'm currently carrying, and the wine and stuff. I should have plenty of money to uh, to pay the fine and the uh, the hotel bills. So as long as I find a little bit of loot, it doesn't even need to be anything particularly good as long as it's not like... Um, uh, what's the textiles? As long as I don't just get textiles as my loot, then I should be able to do the trip without money issues. Okay, damn, she's actually out of cash now, so I can't sell that last wheel tire. Uh, got two more of these. I have so many bloody car jacks just from every, all the soft resetting. So if I try and sell. Oh, there goes a wheel. But 260, that is actually, I think, just below my absolute... Um, so yeah, that's just below my estimate for how much all of the hotel bills were cost. So I am, I'm fairly safe. All I need is a tiny bit of loot, and I'm fairly sure we'll be able to get some of that on the, on the way. So, 1,385... Whew. 
So now I drive over to the... Uh... Oh, actually, I'll clean the car first. Okay. So, now that the banana car is all clean, it's time to drive over to the dealership and purchase the best combination of engine parts available. And I'll be uh, explaining which ones they are and why, because all of the... Where is the dealership? There's the engine, so... Uh, all of the different car parts... Is that it? That might be it over there. All the different car parts are slightly different, so they do get better as you go up the tiers. Oh, it, is it? Fantastic. Uh, they get uh, better as they go up the tiers, but then you have the five makes, and the five makes, I think it's five, are all slightly different, they all focus on different things, they're basically different combinations of the same stats. So, pop the boot, nope, the other one, the bonnet, and get rid of all of this. And that, and that, and that. So, I'm keeping that one. And I've realised I will need to make one more trip in order to fill up my tank to the maximum before the journey so that it's all ready to go. So. <sighs> Hello, I'm going to be buying a lot of stuff from you today. First of all, the engine. Down to squash for the best one. So they're, oh it's just three. So the, there are the different coloured ones. They're all pretty crap. But these ones, uh, they all focus on different things. So uh, like they, they describe themselves as performance, uh, power and quality conditioning. So I think the Carbolites are the, the, they last the longest, but they're not the sort of the most efficient. The power ones are really strong, but don't last as long. And the performance, I think they last, I think they're sort of the middle ground. So I actually have a combination of HSK and Carbolite. So the engine is Carbolite. The fuel tank, the giant fuel tank stores 30 litres. So stock is 10, then 13 to 15. Because, yeah, here you can see, look, 15 litre, 13 litres. So it's not as good, but it's I think it's lighter and has higher durability, whereas that one is, like, heavy uh, and high storage, and that one's, like, uh, higher durability and higher storage, but it is, I don't know, I can't remember. But yes, basically that's that's what the three are. They they swap around the different uh, quality things that you can't even bloody see until you buy them, which is a bit cheeky. So uh, a stout fuel tank, and this one is an HSK one, holds 33 litres, still needs to be mixed with oil. Next is the carburetor, and the carburetor down to the tube one is a carbolite one. Then the air filter, this one is another HSK one. And the ignition coil, triple battery, uh, triple barrel. I did have a carbolite one before I sold it. I will be getting a carbolite one again. So. That is all of the stuff. Oh, and a battery, of course. I'll get a carbolite one. Uh, and you can get a water tank, but of course I still have the Oasis one. So. This is the best engine that I have determined can be made. So, as you can see, that's like... Uh, it's 8 kilometer, eight kilograms... This car is this engine is going to be bloody packed. I'm just telling you that now. I'm really using all the space because that's sort of the intention. Look at this. Ah. Oh. And the last two pieces. Boom. So that holds 33 liters of fuel. And I have absolutely none to put in it. So, oh. Yeah, what I can do is I can just keep soft resetting and getting the free ones while also getting enough oil to stock my uh, supply. 
So, a little bit of soft resetting to finish off. And while I'm doing that, uh, I can talk about the live stream. So, if you followed uh, this series for a while, you'll know that I'll, I'm doing a there and back again live stream in which I will get the there and back again achievement for driving all the way to Turkey and back in a single session. That is a monolith of a task. At the briefest, shortest route, I think it will take me about six hours. At the longest route, I think it is um, about 12 hours. So I am going to... Uh, I'm still not 100% sure whether I want to go for the longest or the shortest. Uh, this, I'm not as enamoured of this game as I used to be, but still I want to sort of do it right. Do I need... Uh, yeah, alright, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put two of these as spares so that when I soft reset to continue filling up the fuel, it will um, give me new ones. So you see if it gives me, I, I, I don't know, maybe I'll go for like the middle range one, maybe I'll go for the longest one it gives me. I, I It will have to depend on how things go. So, uh, restart. The bit that I haven't said up to now is that I do intend to have guests. I won't be saying who they are because at this point it's not actually in, uh, written in stone who my guests are going to be. It sort of depends who I can get. So uh, a variety of people who've appeared on the channel before, I imagine. And uh, what form that'll take, you're going to have to wait and see. I, I'm kind of looking forward to, uh, to that bit. That should be fun. And I will drive all the way to Turkey and back in a single live stream unlock the achievement and I'm really 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 hoping there are no like crashes or anything in, in the middle of it because I don't like achievements that require you to uh, spend a lot of time doing something just in case a tiny thing ruins that like a crash or something uh, but I am confident that I can do this and I'm kind of I'm kind of looking forward to it and that's the main reason I haven't chickened out of doing this I mean a couple of people said that they'd understand completely if I if I gave up um, at the point of uh, the car flipping because yeah that's really fucking hell so <laughs> I didn't and I because I, I was determined to do the live stream basically because I know that I will be um, I'll be going for the achievement anyway. I, to be honest, the achievement that I'm least looking forward to even attempting is max out the odometer. So I have a total of 23 hours currently. I don't know if you saw the overlay just then. I've a total of 23 hours in this game so far. Um, I'm going to replace all the tires as well. That 23 hours has let me travel a total of 14,000 kilometers. The next achievement is for 50,000, and then there is one for 100,000, and then there is one for maxing it out, presumably at 999,000. Fuck my life, I'm not doing that. I really... Ugh, that's one of the grindy achievements. If this game was better, maybe, maybe I'd have gone for it. But as the driving is a ball ache, well, the driving isn't a ball ache. You know, as everything around the driving is a ball ache, you know, it, it's like 420 kilometers is the maximum you can go in a single day. And depending on where you are, it's either generally flat straight roads or it is fucking mountain passes, Bulgaria, you suck. So I'm going to have to do it for the, uh, for the live stream but I don't think I will bother doing it again after that. So I'll swap these tyres, finish loading the oil, because I'm going to take a large supply of oil. Yeah. 
and then I will call it a day for this series. So I'll be doing the live stream both on YouTube and Twitch, I think. Uh, follow me on Twitter, linked in the description for information, and I'll probably do a G-log as it's a planned live stream uh, once I have decided... What's wrong with this tyre? What's wrong with this... What? Why is, what's wrong with that tyre? Why is that tyre not good? Oh, that's one of the ones from there. I put in a not good tyre. All right. Take one of the new ones from up there instead. There we go. Fantastic. So I've got four spare tyres, two full fuel tanks, uh, along with my 33 capacity fuel tank, which should last me like three days uh, anyway. So I'll probably get like most of the way there before I have to refill at all before I have to refill, so I shouldn't need any more fuel tanks. Um, I do actually need to uh, to do the oil, though. I forgot about that. So, let's see. One. Holy crap, it still takes just two. I'm surprised. I thought with that amount of fuel in there, it would require, like, three full bottles to optimise. But no. Cool. And there we go. I'm now ready. I don't need the repair kit because I have my super duper tool rack. I have four spare tires. I have my light, um, my light rack, my ball bar, my roof rack, my replacement door. Yeah, I'm all ready to go. This is the best the banana car ever has or ever will be. So, thank you very much for watching Garin Reaver vs Jalopy. This game was very promising and sadly did not live up to that promise. Nonetheless, I'll be returning to do the There and Back Again uh, live stream where I'll drive all the way to Turkey and back in a single session lasting somewhere between 6 and 12 hours. <clears throat> but I'm kind of looking forward to it. I hope you are too. Thank you very much for watching this series and I hope you have enjoyed it. So. Uh, from me, from Uncle Briefcase, and from Uncle, wherever he is, God rest his soul, we will catch you later.